You know, you would think that a movie called Music from an actual musician would be great, especially when it's from a musician called Sia. And Sia, you know, I have to say this about her. I, I tell you, I love Sia, but for somebody who hates attention, she sure loves being the center of it. She got all them crazy costumes. The whole t- here's the funny thing: the whole time she 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 was out there saying, "You know what? I don't want to be seen. I don't want anybody to know my face. I don't want to. I don't want any attention." And then she goes dressing up like some goddamn mutant cartoon character and shit. You know, well, it, it, it's a dichotomy to be expected, where she's like, "I want the attention like everybody else, but I feel like I'm too old, and they'll just laugh at me." Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, we won't laugh at you for some crazy shit like this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you go right ahead there. All right. Yeah, ain't nobody laughing at this goddamn mutant Betty Boop shit we got right here. But, you know, for somebody who wasn't one attention and wearing all the crazy costumes and whatnot, all the, should I say, should I say attention grabbing costumes out there, uh, she's also constantly caught up in controversies, man. Especially if you are Shia LaBeouf. You know, uh, old Boofy right here. You know, she was in the controversy first having him dance around the cage half naked with a little girl. <laughs> I didn't have a problem with it, but you know, I, I, a lot of people did. And I, like I said, I didn't have a problem with this myself. This is for uh, her, her video, Elastic, Elastic Heart. Oh, that was for a video? I thought that was just something he did on the weekend. You thought that? Yeah, you thought that was a hostage. <laughs> you thought that was a dungeon that he had right there. No, that was a video. I'd have a problem with it, but I could have said, if I had seen this, I would have said, you know, uh, so I, you know I, 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 don't, I like it, but I, I just expect people to say things. And they did. And if that wasn't enough, she said, well, ain't nobody talking about that anymore, so let me just go throw Shia back out there. You know, Shia, man, he, he duped me into having sex with him. So she stays in controversy with this guy right here. Wait, I'm sorry, what? Oh, you didn't hear about this? She says, no. I, was, I, I was duped into, unless I got this wrong, she said, I was duped into having sex with Shia LaBeouf, who she says was married at the time. So, yeah, uh, man. Okay. Yeah, so, you know, look, like I said, you know, when the controversy goes away, the girl says, well, shit, let me start some shit again. <laughs> Oh, she's not. I thought I cut your ass down. It's almost down. Like, he, like he said, look, girl, our names are so similar. It's destiny for us to have sex. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, man. You played mind games on me. <laughs> Sire is Shia sitting in a tree. <laughs> K-I-S. F-U-S-F-U-C-K-I-N-G. But... So when that controversy is gone, all right, so we stopped talking about my costumes. We stopped talking about Shia LaBeouf in both cases. Ah, uh, well, I guess I got to do something. Let me go ahead and make this crazy ass movie right here. Maybe that'll get people talking. Or maybe she just meant to make a film, but it still has people talking nonetheless. We're talking about her m- movie music. And with this, before we get into the controversy, I'll just tell you what this is about. So uh, music is an autistic girl played by Maddie Ziegler. She has a routine every day with her grandmother. But when her grandmother dies, she has no family left except for her recovering alcoholic sister, who's played by Kate Hudson. Now, needless to say, uh, with her going to this person who, for the most part, they, I mean, listen, they're, re- they're, they're trying to recover, but they're still adjusting and they're not exactly at the most responsible level in their life. Kate Hudson, that is, her character in this film. So music is going to have to make some adjustments. She still has the magical, mystical Negro neighbor next door, played by, what's your boy, what's your boy from Hamilton, Odell? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Leslie Odom Jr. Leslie Odom Jr. right there. And every now and then things get too rough. She still has fantasy dance number musical sequences that go off in her head. People, that sounds downright heartwarming. Every the, all the intentions here, they sound, they sound good. What's the problem? Well, I don't know. You know, maybe if you look at the trailer, because you just hear me telling you about it. Maybe if you look at the trailer for yourself, maybe you can see what people are talking about, or maybe not. But I'll tell you what, what side do we fall on? We'll see after we watch this trailer for music and be right back with our review. <laughs> Yeah, yours to own on February 15th. Take this shit off my hands. <laughs> it's got too much heat on it. People, now, I don't know. 
there's been different responses. Everybody has a different way of looking at this. So I don't want to act like I'm, I'm, of course, I'm speaking for myself. I don't know how Martin feels about this. We did not talk about this. And also, let me come in and just say that Sia, huge fan, huge fan. I remember listening to Sia before I knew her name, before a lot of people knew her name. Uh, I was a big fan of Sia when I heard of her through a French electronic band I used to listen to back in the day and still listen to. One of my favorite songs, not from her Sia, but just favorite songs that I listen to constantly is, uh, is Destiny from Zero Seven featuring Sia. know that song man just that little bit right there y'all know that that's uh that is destiny from zero seven featuring sia i didn't even know who she was at the time but i absolutely love that song had that song on repeat a lot and uh finally started hearing about sia and i was like wow that girl from that band obscure band i used to listen to she's blowing up so i'm 100 behind whatever sia wants to do man 100% when I heard she was making a movie because I remember I, I forgot about it but I remember hearing that she was going to be making a film I was like that's amazing I love seeing people expand their talents man I'm 100% behind this except when I looked at this I looked at this and 10 minutes in I'm like I I, <laughs> I said out loud what the fuck see 